So we're going to the train station right now. Uh -huh. It's a little wet, but hey, you know. Love it. At least the weather's nice and it feels good. It's not like 90 degrees. Right here at Pukuksa, which is a mountain site, and it's gonna be pretty cool to check out. So scratch that. This place is not the mountain site, but more of the temple site. This temple so far has been absolutely beautiful. There's a lot of people here, but a lot of fun and it's very historic but man lots of walking uphill man but still totally worth it so if you guys ever come to South Korea this place come to this temple it's it's fun to look at and just see how beautiful the architecture is and just the landscape itself Whew. what was the significance when we first came into the temple there's two statues on each side when we were walking up. inside the inside the gate. Inside the gate, what did what what is the significance? It, uh, it symbolizes four kings, the keeping this temple safe okay. against those devil spirits coming, like the demons, right? Demons, they they're gonna kill them. Oh wow! So and this is a Buddhist temple. Oh yeah, Buddhist temple. We're leaving the temple right now and it was absolutely gorgeous to see something about our past for like you know what people believed in for their spiritual lives to uh you know keep them going day to day it's pretty beautiful still buddhist. yes they were still buddhists actually up there um taking care of the grounds yeah but people come those who are buddhist to like bow down to different various statues of statues their god yeah. Gods. It was a little yeah. creepy. <laughs> so that's a little creepy, but you know, it was actually really cool to check out different monuments and different statues of the different gods and what they believed in. It's beautiful. This food is so good. Gotta love authentic Korean foods. This is eating right now. Pulogi. What is it? Hold on. This is what we ordered. Mm. So we're currently at the top of a mountain site and it is absolutely gorgeous. See, we're really high up and you should be able to see this. And it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's just a little, just a little cloudy and foggy today. I'm about to ring the bell for mercy and for hope. done visiting the Buddhist temple sorry I couldn't take video of the inside of it it was actually apparently super sacred ground so they want to not allow me to take video or take any pictures which I understand you know it's their religious beliefs so we can't be exposing you know all the things that are inside the temple which it was really cool I think my sister might have taken a picture she might send it to me and we might post it later we'll see we'll see who knows I might get cursed or something who knows but we're back in the train station and then we're gonna go straight to the shopping district. We're gonna check it out, see what kind of foods they got, different clothes. I think it'll be pretty cool.
made it to Busan. After many hours, we survived the last train. This man over here killed like 50 zombies. She killed about, you know, a good 47 with her headdress pillow. You know, we were definitely on that last train to Busan too, so. But we're finally here, right? I think we're all exhausted and we're ready to pass out. How about you? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so we're getting on the elevator to our next Airbnb that we'll be staying for the next four days, three nights. We'll see how it goes.